I believe we've been here a week today so this time last week we were on the way to Walt Disney World we're just about to check out of Riviera we had a little bit of a late check-in because dad didn't feel too good this morning today is boxing day the um, bell service just come up to get the cases um, you might have seen already we are in a one bedroom at Riviera that we're checking out of it's been a really really nice room um, our plan for today as it's just gone 12 o'clock we're having a chill day we're gonna head down to celebration shortly have a little drive around probably go to Walmart and Target today have a little nose down there um, and then checking into Old Key West later in this afternoon and then today we have a park reservation for Epcot and also it's extended evening Mommy, hours I'm at Epcot. yes darling because we have a view as you can in the distance of World Showcase and Spaceship Earth is there so we could see Harmonious, you can see probably one of the barges there in the middle. A bit difficult to see, but it's over there somewhere. So yeah, we had a fantastic view of the fireworks, which was really nice. But yeah, um, once we've checked into Alkey West, uh, as I said, Epcot has extended evening hours for deluxe resort guests, uh, which also includes obviously DVC members if you're staying there at the time. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go to Epcot later in this evening is the plan. I just have a bit of a chilled one today. We're all a little bit tired, I think. And as I said, we're sort of slowing it down this trip and doing things differently than we would normally do. We normally go park in the morning, rest, park in the evening, but we're just sort of doing a little bit slower today. So yeah, hopefully tomorrow, Wednesday and Thursday, meeting up with our cousins that are here. Hi, baby. Livia's doing her own little vlog today. Um, so yeah, hopefully meeting up with the family tomorrow, Wednesday and Thursday, which would be really nice. And yeah, so we're just gonna have a chill day. But as I said, if you're like, uh, if you want to come along and follow our journey what have they got to do Liv? give us a subscribe to our channel that would be really greatly appreciated give us a thumbs up give us a thumbs down either way it helps the algorithm we don't mind um but please give us a comment below if you've been to walk disney world or what you love about disney like what trips do you do do you do different trips if you've done a christmas trip before have you stayed at riviera have you stayed at all these different resorts just give us a comment and follow along love to be part of the disney community and making loads of new disney friends which is what we love um but yeah i'm gonna end this now and we'll catch up with you when we are on the way to celebration see you guys soon we are currently in celebration just have a little drive through there's Olivia in the background oh look there's some oh there's a couple of deflated ones down there <gasps> look at this house in the end Liv look at that Whoa. oh my goodness look oh, at yeah, that wow <gasps> we need to come up here later look at this I think we should have a walk up there. I wonder if this is the road that everyone talks about that has all the stuff on it. I think it might be. I don't know if Dad's lost Church. or not. No. But I think this is the way we normally go. Um, the yeah, little, little way to manger, remember that one? Way to manger, the little church. Yeah. Well, yeah, we thought we'd come down here and just um, have a little drive. We've not been down here yet. And I don't think Liv's been down there, has she? No, I think we've never been well, down here. Well, maybe. We might have done one trips too. Little bits up there and there, one. Got the, just, this is like house goals as well. I'd love to live. I'd love to have one of the big houses down there. The nice big pool. If I don't live here, it would have to be gold note because that is the other option. Mm -hmm. We are going to see your cousins tomorrow, darling, yes. Yes, Olivia. Yeah, she ain't trying to watch it from school. Pardon? Are you going to walk? Yeah, probably, I expect so. I 
Which is like so dark. Yes. The town hall. Yeah, that's the town hall. Mm. Just close it. It's, it's so lovely. If you haven't been down to Celebration, it's, it's literally like the next junction down from Disney, isn't it? Just look at the junction. Look for market street. Exit 62, is it? I think I can see the Yeah, we're here now. Just coming look for in. Market Street and just coming. And um, it's a sunny little town. Just got to drive it's very carefully. white picket fancy, but drive it's um, yeah. 20, it's a 20 mile an hour. Yeah, yeah, but it's it's beautiful. It really is. Celebration Hotel. That's a big hotel. Isn't it? Yes. Oh, can we stop talking about your friend? I'm trying to do a video. Yeah, this is <laughs> it is really lovely here. I think you normally park up here somewhere, don't you? Uh, I don't know. Is it restricted? Yeah, park? Uh, I think it's okay. One hour. Oh, this is all the. Oh, you can park for an hour. Yeah, we can park here for an hour. Is that going to be enough time? What right the other side? Is the other side restricted? Uh, is this the little. Bank of the Town Square. Market Street. So you can't park down there. Oh, I've got all the Christmas bits. Oh my god, it's a Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. That looks cute. Oh, is that the little corner deli place that everyone mentions about going to? Right, there's a little wonder deli, it might be down here. Mm, I don't know, I can't see. So we just got down to celebration. Having a little wander around now. I think quite a few places are shut today, but we're so. Oh no, it is open. A little place here. We're just going to have a wander and then we'll come back. And this is like the main little square. Oh my god, look at this. How cute is this? A little wander first. Yeah. How cute is that? It's really nice here. Yeah. Oh, look at that. They've got a little ice rink in the middle here. And there's the tree. I'm so glad we've come down today because it's a bit warmer. Yeah. Market Street Gallery. Yeah, we'll have to have a little the bakery over there. Oh, I think they normally eat in that place down here on the right. Oh, the tree is beautiful. And here's the little lake down here. We're going to have a look in there. Oh, it's beautiful, it really is. So, Olivia wants to show you her ring. Let's have a look. So, you can see that. We got this in the um, boutique store. So, you can see it's so, so, with Niera. So, we're at the downtown diner. Don't really know what we're going to eat now. Mm -hmm. I've got some good food though. I've got some omelettes, look quite nice. French toast and waffles, pancakes. Had you breakfast till two. I've got brunch stuff. Oh, we've got some cold sandwiches, Dad. I might have one of them. Cold sandwiches, burgers, beverages, and then a little kids meal as well. Let's see how we get on. So, we are at the downtown diner in celebration. This is Dad's very small apple juice. Is it my one? This is Olivia's is apple juice. Dad's? And this is my ginormous Coke. Look at the difference between mine and Dad's. <laughs> let go, let go. Right, what have you ordered for your food? Uh, Chocolate chip pancakes. Dad, when he stops dying, has ordered French toast. And I've gone for an omelette, like a build your own omelette. Mummy, he didn't make it on here. Okay, alright, stop shouting though, please. And I've got, yeah, build your own omelette with chicken, mushrooms, and bacon. So we'll let you know what we think. I'm oh, yeah, and take the tops as a side. We've got loads of seating outside. I'm a shoulder. Can you stop talking? There's all seats outside, though. And look out, it's outside by the lake. Tater tops and my omelette just arrived. Liv's got chocolate chip pancakes and Dad's got his French toast. We'll let you know how we get on with it. But you want syrup, do you? So we've just finished our food here at the downtown diner. It was really good, really nice food. Omelette oh, was really nice. We're gonna. Um, Dad wants a coffee from Starbucks. He wants a proper cappuccino, don't you? So um, yeah, food come. I think with like a tip to about. 
45 dollars i think we paid my i had omelette like pick your own omelette uh, which is really good as i said liv loved her pancakes i'd like his french toast but yeah they've got all this outside seating area so yeah we'll definitely be back at some point and um, it's really good as i said there's lots of other places like here you can eat starbucks over there doesn't go get his coffee and then we're gonna have a little look around by the lake i think yeah it was really good and it's like a proper like american 50 style proper diner and it was really delicious so we're just by the lake now and celebration and we found the rocking chairs dad's got his cappuccino from starbucks that's the little diner we had food in just now over there and then um, yeah Liv's got her ring on still we're just gonna we're gonna sit here for long 10 15 minutes the sun's out now which is quite nice it's nowhere near as cold as what it was is it it's a lot more mild milder today isn't it is it down Hey, careful. Is it good? Little birds. But um, no, it's beautiful. Really, really nice. Nice and peaceful boxing day for us. Mm, yeah, definitely. Just where we've just been sitting down there. Little chairs. Really lovely up here. There's the tree and stuff over there. I think Liv and Dad have gone that way up towards the cinema. A little one, though, I see they gone. A little walking trail, looks like there's a little, um, Maybe a dog bakery or grooming or something over there looks interesting. But these decorations are lovely, look at those. Actually got the sunglasses back out. It's nice. You can hear some music playing up here, let's see what that is. But yeah, you've got the cinema up here, but having just a nice chilled afternoon in celebration. We haven't been in it down for a couple of years since I think I don't think we even bought Livy here in 2019. Let's go have to see where Daddy Liv gone now. I'm just gutted there's nothing like this at home. Like, so what, darling? Oh, it's not a cinema? Oh, right. Oh, right. Oh, well, that's a shame. Oh, okay. I assume other people, you guys might have known that already. It's not the cinema anymore. It's the same. It's nice just to look back now, though, and just see where we were. Obviously, Starbucks is over there in the corner. I think it's over there. There it is. And that's where we were over there. We're not going to walk all the way up, like I said, we're just out for a little bit. It's really nice here though. As I said, if you haven't been to Celebration, definitely come and check it out. Um, the weather's definitely picking up today. Still need jackets on at the moment, but hopefully later. This is fascinating though, because you can see the old ticket booths here. Look at this. These are the old ticket booths. But they used to obviously take the tickets on. And this would have been where I've done like your popcorn and your drinks and stuff. So yeah, it's really sad actually. It's really sad. Signs, 
pick one. Quick, I've got my ring. Okay. This is a crazy house I saw just now. Look at all these inflatables on your left. Just go slow down here. Yeah. yeah. Look at this house on the left, guys. Oh. oh. And I look at all of those. And there is a mini moon one. Look at those. That's insane. Oh. Turn left at minions. Some minions. Left at minions. <gasps> that one's got loads up. Beautiful houses. Like you like this house here? Yeah. That one's got some candy canes outside. Oh, I love the the flames, oh my god, look at this. They've got a Millennium Falcon outside. <laughs> Stop, look at this. Wow, look at that. Oh my god. They're amazing. I'm going to turn around. These are really nice, Do you even like these apartment Mommy. buildings, they're lovely. Mummy. Look at those like Georgian townhouses, yeah. like, that's more like London. Yeah. I like all the little mailboxes like that. They're cool. Yeah, okay. yeah these are very London looking, aren't they, these ones? Like Mike Wazowski. They look like the uh, embassies in London. Yeah. Very much like Chelsea looking, aren't they? Yeah, Knightsbridge. Got some really nice inflatables down there. Can you see any living? Oh, look lovely. on the left, there's a Millet Star Wars stuff. Very like, amazing. See this one out your window now? That's so look good. Look at there now. Look, see look at that. Look at the Millennium Falcon and all that. Oh, did you do Is it? These ones that have been deflated. Yeah. Oh, they've got big nutcrackers. Oh, they had loads up there, deflated them oh, all. Oh, they've got a house down the back. Look at that. At least I can look at this uh, Disney one on the right. It looked oh, phenomenal. Ah. <gasps> Look at this one, guys. Well, that one's really cute. I like that one. But look at this showstopper. This is a Disney house. Look. Beautiful. Look at that. Mickey, Minnie. Oh, my goodness. Candy Castle. I'm obsessed. I want to live there. That looks so good. So good. I think we parked up here once yeah. before, didn't we? I remember. And then Actually, I think we got... Can, I mean, there's no restrictions. No, you can park here. It's a little bit further out. Um, oh, so that's had a bit too much. <laughs> but yeah, if you guys have never been to Celebration, do come down here. Market Street. For an afternoon. It's Market Street is the area you're looking for. Um, it's quite easy to get here. Hello, Olivia. Um, it's literally, as I said, like the next junction down from Disney. Is it exit 62? 62. Off of the, the I-4. I-4 West. I-4 West if you're coming. I-4 West Tampa. And um, yeah, definitely come down here. Golf course, <laughs> lovely. But yeah, honestly, it's really nice down here, as I said. And um, if you can come down for an afternoon for a couple of hours or something, definitely come down and have a have a little walk around. Gonna get a coffee or something to bite tweet. Um, but it's really lovely, isn't it? We've never obviously been down at Christmas time. Never stopped. Never stopped. We've driven through. It. Never yeah, I don't think we've ever stopped. And I think once we got out of the car, but we didn't actually really go anywhere. But um, we've seen a, a few couple of vlogs now with the Lodge guys and Aidan Lee, so I'll shout out to you guys. Very nice. And um, and also KPJP Florida, go give them a follow as well. And um, yeah, that? definitely. They've stopped doing that, please. Here we are celebration. Celebration Boulevard. Um, as I said, yeah, definitely come down and check it out. It's a really lovely, nice area. Disney used to own this town. They don't own it anymore. But it was sort of like Walt's idea for like a Disney neighbourhood sort of thing. Yeah, anyway, we're going to end this bit here. We're going to now head over to, I think, Walmart and have a little wander and see what we can get in Walmart. We've never been to Walmart before, so it's all new to us. No. Where are we, Dad? We're at Walmart. First ever time. We've never been to Walmart. We're Walmart. I don't know why. 
we went to Target, you know, because that was the first yeah. time to a Target, so this is the first for us. We've only been to a small Target though, it wasn't a big Target. I don't know how big this Walmart is, it might not be the biggest one. I, I think this is the one off the 192. Yeah, so let's go and see what Walmart's got to offer because we don't actually know what we're looking for. But yeah, we'll let you know how we get in anyway. Yeah. Um, this one is great. Let's go have a nose. Dad's panicking because some bloke apparently stopped at green light. <laughs> anyway, what I was trying to vlog about was before Dad started getting weird. Um, so we went to Walmart for the first time. Wow. That is bigger than I thought it was going to be. I don't know if it was like the biggest one. It said Superstore, so I assumed it was quite big anyway. Yes, Olivia. Can in one second, but we're back on Disney property now. Very happy. Caribbean Beach. Um, Caribbean Beach is coming up on the right. There's the skyliner. Oh, there's the rentals for the uh, strollers and the. East oh, that's Buena Vista rentals, isn't it? Yeah. I can't see it now because the bus Sorry. is in the way. You ruined it. <laughs> I can't see it. <laughs> Dad's whinging about everything today, as per usual. Obviously, it's there. Safety first. Us top drivers of Disney. <laughs> <laughs> really? Don't even need sat now when they're in a place like Batman. All right, tell me how to get to Argy West then. Um, we're going to go right here. And mm -hmm. then, then where? On the left somewhere before you get to Disney Springs, there'll be like a sign. All right. Onky West. Okay. And you go around that way. Okay. You See, tell me where to go then, because I don't believe you right now. I don't know. Oh, I don't think you do though, do you? Yes, I'll be Mr. Right. Dale then. Yeah, in a minute, in a minute, baby. But anyway, Walmart was okay, yeah. as I said. Um, Sorry, I <laughs> just can't go back. Look at what Driving. All right, here we go. Here we go. But no, the prices in Walmart nice were, were really good considering. Yeah. Um, yeah, Riviera's oh, yeah. here, isn't it? Our little house that we're at earlier. Bye, Bye, Bye Riviera. Bye. Probably see you later in the week at some point. Yeah. Okay. Well, if we're on the, on the skyliner. Yeah, we'll get the skyliner. Bye, Riviera. See you soon. We're just getting to Old Key West. Oh, it's decorated pretty. I love it. So guys, welcome to our room tour of an old Key West Deluxe Studio. Um, this sleeps up to four guests and we've just turned up, we are in building 63, our room is 6325 and it's literally directly pretty much across from like the lobby and concierge which is ideal. So this is the main front door. As you turn around you've got a big queen, queen bed here, loads of under the bed storage. And there's your second bed with under the bed storage again. Two little drawers in the middle, which is really nice. And we've got the Bible in one of them. That's always good to see. Plenty of storage though. Um, USBs, I think have been added because I don't think they had them. Um, we did get a little gift, which looks like an old Key West magnet and a little card from housekeeping just to say, welcome home. There's another little view here. And uh, this is the TV and dresser. TV's a bit smaller, but not a problem for us. It's got our name on it. I think there is a little Sony HDMI thing. Four nice big drawers there. There's a bin and stuff over there. This is the door that goes through to the one bedroom lock off. There's Dad and Olivia at the little table. There are also plugs down here with USBs now. And I don't think they had them, but I think these have been added recently because on other vlogs I never saw them. Um, Dad loves this picture and I would love to buy this. Oh, this is amazing. It tells you all the different location areas and you can see it because the light's on. Um, more plugs down here and some others over there. And then if you turn to the right, we have a balcony overlooking the golf course. And I'm sure this particular room I've seen in the vlog before because it looks almost identical. But lovely little balcony and uh, maybe we'll pop out there later. 
Just going to show you the rest of the room quickly. Just going to turn around and show you the bathroom and kitchenette area. This is the kitchenette area that we've got. We've got a toaster, microwave, little shelf with some disposable cutlery and cups and things, little sink. Uh, down here you've got a kitchen towel, like bin, things like that. Uh, coffee maker, some Joffrey's coffee, um, stirrers and coffee make milk. Nice big fridge. And I think there's a little freezer section as well. Oh yes, there's a freezer. So we can get them here premium bars. And then behind us is like a little closet. Extra pillow and blanket up there. Proper iron that dad likes. The safe, the safe isn't a digital safe, but it's still big enough to put your things in. A little bit squeaky. You've got two hoovers for some reason. And mop and whatever else. And some hangers, which is always handy. So that all tucks in nicely. You can also put your suitcases and whatever else from there. This is the bathroom. I'm just going to show you from this end first. Bear with me. So on the front door of the bathroom, you've got a big full length mirror that goes down. Excuse me. <laughs> As we come in, you've got sink there, towels and storage space underneath with toilet rolls and things like that. Some H2O sea salt body lotion and the facial soap which will be going in my suitcase to go home. Uh, lovely nice big mirror with the lights on up here, nice big sink. We've done our hair check, there's no hair, we're all good and really happy, which sounds a bit dramatic but we have to check. Hair dryers down there, more storage space, got some plugs in there for like your razor and things. Um, obviously the standard toilet, toilet roll bin. Um, there's some towels up here and like hooks for anything on the back of the door. Then the H2O products in the bath. Nice little bath that you can have. All H2O stuff. And a big shower up there. Not as keen on the shower curtain, but I can deal with that. And I think there are some hidden Mickeys on here somewhere. Can you see this? Like It's like an upside down hidden Mickey, which is super cool. And I think there's also little hidden Mickeys on these, because I've seen these on books as well. They're really cool. So yeah, that is the room. Dad's doing his little checks. Yeah, I just said it looks really good. So just to see the room from this side, there's quite there's plenty of space here for you know for four people. Um, like obviously you've got this extra bit here that you can just put your cases in around the bed. So yeah, we are here for seven nights. And um, yeah, if I just show you by the window quickly, you can see how close we are. Oh, if I can actually get through all of this luggage. So literally just over there in the corner is where the main building is. So we're close to everything. We're on a first floor, uh, second floor, sorry. We're upstairs and our car's just parked us around the corner. So yeah, I'm really happy because last time we were in building 51 and we were at the other end of the resort and we were just miles away. So yeah, really chuffed. But it also looks like we've got a little gift as well. What's this? Should we have a little look? Yeah. Got a little card. It? Okay, let Grandad open it. Let's see what we got. I'm opening it. Hold on. Wait. Wait. Oh. Leave it alone. Let Grandad open it first. Okay. See what it says. Uh, yeah, from the hotel manager. I'm the hotel manager. Yeah, and what have we much. got in here? I'm opening. Go on then. Maybe you can open it. What have we got? Could it be chocolates? <gasps> Mickey chocolate. Oh my goodness. <laughs> wow, that's okay. really cool. Wow. Wait, there's a lot. I think we should have one. Hang on, let's just check. What are they? Does it say underneath what they are? Okay, so it actually says underneath. They're just dark chocolate and milk chocolate. At least there's allergy things on there as well. But yeah, how cute is that? And this is our little card we got here. That just says um, Disney Sulky West Resort, a DVC Club Resort. And it's on there. Lives in a little video for a friend because that's what she wants to do. But anyway, I'm going to end the room tour now. As I said, we've just checked in to Alkey West. We're going to head out to Epcot in a little bit, uh, check on the wait times. And we're, I think we're going to unpack first a little bit because we're here for a week now. So we've got time to unpack, sort things out. And um, yeah, we'll catch up with you when we head to Epcot a little bit later. See you later. <laughs> Wow. That's what we saw in the room.
an emotional wreck all the time. So we've obviously just watched the beacon. Um, every time we come, we keep missing it. We kept missing it in the summer, but wow. It's all lit up. Um, and so as you haven't noticed already, we've just got to Epcot. We parked up, we've just scanned in. It's now just gone seven, and the park shuts at half nine for everybody else. Spaceship Earth is uh, a no-go at the moment. Oh wow, look at Spaceship Earth. Moving, but we can go looks, away. I want to say at least 45 minutes maybe. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we need it's to go this way. It's just 10 that's, minutes. That's not a 10 minute way, unless it's broken it's down. We turn this way. Dad's down the wrong way again. We're going to go to Connections Eatery, is it called? Try and get some food. But yeah, part shuts at half nine for everyone else, and then they've got extended evening hours for deluxe resort guests. So we get to slash, Yeah. Uh, until half past 11 tonight. Actually, Probably not going to say to half 11. That's when we might get to do Ratatouille. So we're hopefully going to try and do Ratatouille later. Because yes. we're not really going to have much of a chance otherwise, I don't yeah. think. Unless we come here at the crack of dawn one day, which is possible. Or this is everybody else leaving. This is the sea of people leaving at the <laughs> They're leaving early, actually, Because they want to get out because it's cold. Oh, it's Boxing Day as well. It's Boxing Day, not, not that, that, that no, no one celebrates it. I heard someone saying earlier, what, well, how's Boxing Day? I was like, yeah, um, it's a UK thing and Canada thing, I think, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. But yeah, let's uh, go get some food. That's the plan. Oh, we're here already. Yeah, it's just up here. So not too far. Yeah. So we're at Epcot. We went and had food at Connections Eatery. We've then been on Living with the Land. And we've just done Figment. We also did the Awesome Planet little show. There's Spaceship Earth on it up, looking pretty. It's now extended evening hours for deluxe resort guests. <laughs> and um, we're going to go on Spaceship Earth and Nemo, I think. Should we leave the shoulder here? Oh. Yeah. We'll come back to the shoulder later, there's no point. Oh my god, that's super bright. But yeah, I thought whilst everyone's going to watch Harmonious, we can go on Nemo. Why would you not? So yeah, let's go on Nemo. So we've done Spaceship Earth. We were the only ones in the line. I oh, saw it's a bit dark. We're now queuing up for Nemo. 
and we're the only ones in the line. <laughs> it's about 10 o'clock now. After this, we're gonna try, because Harmony's just finishing, so this is super dark. Harmony's just finishing, so we're gonna try and do Ratatouille in a minute and head over there, and hopefully the queue would have gone down. If we get time, we'll also do Sorry. Super excited tonight, we've got loads done. So let's go on Nemo. There's no one here. I can't believe this. There's no one on Nemo, it's just us. Our oh, dad's gonna get scared by the jellyfish again, aren't you? Let's go explore the big blue world! Wow. Wow. Hey, we can't explore without Nemo! Not sure we'll see him any minute now. Wow. 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 We're in the land pavilion. There is not a soul in sight. We're going down to Soaring now to try. It is about five past ten. We were the only ones on Nemo, there was actually no one there. And um, yeah, there's not a soul in sight. I've never seen it so quiet before. The land is also still running. I know it's not, the land's finished now, they've shut it. The land, but they've shut it across now. Which I'm a bit gutted about, because I would have, well they've shut it across, haven't they? I would have gone on it. I think the land's shut, I'm a bit sad about. But yeah, let's go on soaring, why not? Let's go, I'm sorry. It's on a 30 minute wait, but that is not 30 minutes, I tell you now. It's basically closed anyway. We're walking down for soaring. Aren't we, baby? Gonna do soaring. I think Liv's a little bit tired, but there's no one here. I'm gonna ask for B, B1, if there's no one there in a minute, but we'll see what happens. Yeah. We're in the queue for Rappatiri, and it's 10 minute wait. And I think we're gonna walk on it. <laughs> so we did soaring the last time you saw us. Came off soaring and now we're doing this. So let's see if we walk straight on. We only done this once in August. Oh my god, it's all gone. I can't go look at it. Okay, baby. Yeah. Give you a wait for granddad, please. I can't believe this. Thank you. 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 Thank on Boxing Day, Christmas week, mate, we did it. We just done. We just did Ratatouille, walk on, zero, about one minute wait time. No, it wasn't even a minute late. We literally just walked straight on it. We walked down all the way through, got to the front, and we just got on straight away. And there's a couple of people that have gone in the queue now, but not very many. But it's about 10 to 11 feet now. And it's in the leave now, it's finished about half an hour, so we're going to head out of the park because it's late and we've got to walk back to the park yet anyway. But I'm so chuffed we got that done. We didn't need lightning lane. It's Boxing Day. It's Christmas week. So nearly 100 minutes. Earlier, that was about 110 minutes, I think, earlier I saw it at. Maybe more. And the lowest it went to earlier was about 55 minutes. It probably wasn't 55 minutes an hour ago. But I wanted to... But it changed on the... Um, my experience. Yeah, there's a lot of people heading now because it's the end of the night. And I think 
yeah, it's just got 11, so most of them are thinking, no, I'll do it as the last ride. Yeah, I think a lot of these people went on test track and stuff, which I'm not fussed about. We don't loads of times before, so second time doing Ratatouille here. Um, yeah, did you enjoy it again? It was good, wasn't it? It's such a fun ride. And Liv was desperate to do it, so I'm glad we got that done. We can do Frozen another time. But just saying how pretty the park looks at this time of night. It's really nice and it's so quiet here. I just said to Dad that for extended evening hours during Christmas week, I don't think an awful lot of people would be staying on site maybe because it's quite expensive and um, also it's very cold weather so I don't think a lot of people would stay maybe and I think I would try it. Uh, when we done this in the summer it was still really busy wasn't it? Yeah. Um, so yeah we have got extended evening hours at Magic Kingdom I think on in a couple of days time so we might try that I don't know we'll have to play it by ear uh, but meeting up with the cousins tomorrow which we're excited about aren't we at Hollywood yeah. Studios so I'm going to end the vlog for now I think because it'll be quite late by the time we get back to uh, Old Key Rest but we'll um, catch up with you tomorrow okay. and uh, yeah if you like our vlogs and everything please give us a comment not a yawn a like <laughs> Dad's so tired, he's getting old. But yeah, give us a comment, give us a like, give us a subscribe. Like it or don't like it, either way, it helps the algorithm anyway, doesn't it? Um, and then follow us on Instagram, we'll chat to you later. It did take forever to get the food though. Their mobile ordering seems to just be a bit off in the evenings. I find every time we had this in August as well, and mobile ordering just takes like over an hour to get it booked. So, anyway, I queued up for like 25 minutes, got the food, headed on Living with the Land. Then we did Figment and Nemo, which Liv wanted to do. Then the park closed at half nine, and there was Harmonious on. They had extended evening hours for deluxe resort guests, which included us, until half 11. We went and managed to get on Soarin', which is a walk-on, and we got on Ratatouille, which was a walk-on at 10 to 11 at night. We've just got back to the room, it's almost midnight, so I'm going to crash out, end this now, and we'll catch up with you tomorrow. Please give us a comment below, follow us, and we'll see you tomorrow, guys. Good night. Right, so Liv's going to do a taste test. This is her chocolate sauce for churro. Baby dip, careful. Little bit, wait, let it drip, hold on. That's it, wait, wait, right, go on then. Is that good? What is it out of ten? Ten out of one. Ten out of one? Is that real? Okay. No, no. Ten out of one hundred. Okay, alright, okay. Liv is currently doing her own little vlog as you can see. I think she needs a phone. Her own phone because she keeps borrowing mine and my dad's constantly trying to do videos, but yeah. <laughs> Finally, finally on the fifth trip here, we're walking down Sunset Boulevard and here's the snow that you probably can't see. And um, we're walking down to the Hollywood Tower. Look at the snow coming down. <laughs> look at that. Oh, look at that. <laughs> That's amazing.
Christmas.